Well, it has taken 33 years just to get to this point today. We, the jury, find as follows as to count one of the charge. The defendant is guilty of first-degree murder of Robin Cornell. Joseph Zeiler guilty of first-degree murder for killing 32-year-old Lisa Story and 11-year-old Robin Cornell 30 years ago. And now it's time for Zeiler to pay for his crimes. And the same jury that convicted Zeiler of double homicide is back in court this morning to decide if he lives in prison or dies. Wink News reporter Asha Patel is live from the Lee County Courthouse. Asha, why is this penalty phase of this trial unique? It's unique because this is the first penalty phase where only eight out of the 12 jurors have to agree on the death penalty phase. Now today is the start of the penalty phase and this is where jurors will decide if Joseph Zeiler spends the rest of his life behind bars or be put to death. Now the jury convicted Joseph Zeiler last week for the murders of 11 year old Robin Cornell and her babysitter 32 year old Lisa Story. This happened in 1990 in Cape Coral. It took years and years for justice to finally be served. Now that same jury who convicted him will hear evidence from both sides and likely hear from the victims families as well. An order from the circuit court of Lee County was given to Zeiler to undergo a psychological evaluation according to Lee County Court court documents. The psychological evaluation happened on Monday. And again, this is the penalty phase. It is expected to start today. And the group of jurors will decide if Joseph Zeiler spends the rest of his life behind bars or be put to death. And again, only eight out of the 12 jurors have to decide, have to agree on the death penalty. Now, we will have a Wink News crew in that courtroom, and we'll be sure to give you the latest update. For now, I'm live in Lee County. Ash Patel, Wink News.